The cleanup exercise was led by the head of service, Barrister Antonio Kumbawa, supported by Body of Permanent Secretaries, Civil Commissioners, Management of the State Waste Management Board, and different volunteers. The areas cleaned up include Upper Market, Adjoining Streets, Lagos Street and Environs, New Benin and Ekiosa also benefited from the exercise as heaps of refuse in the areas were evacuated. Governor is doing better work and uh, as they do bad debt, I wish him good luck and uh, more, more many, many years. It made the motorway away the party, the train, they come more less. Made the thing on the day grant. In case of saving for, you know, go enter the grant. The head of service, some civil commissioners and volunteers comment. We know the governor's interest and passion for the environment. And so we felt that to celebrate him, it would be apposite to use an opportunity like this, you know, to clean the environment. The cost, not of government, but the body of permanent secretaries and the head of service. The idea is to imbibe the spirit or the culture of cleanliness, which is our original cultural value. His desire for a clean city, his penchant for a clean environment, that's why we set out today to do the symbolic cleanup. So far, we, we are getting the cooperation of our people, uh, you know, and they are very happy with what we are doing. State government places um, uh, priority on ensuring that the, our environment is always clean. We want to know as a government how we are improving the environment and what they want us to, you know, do for them. Ultimately, there's a large plan to green and clean. Edo. The team made donations to Rosalie Exceptional Students Academy on behalf of Governor Baseki. We have a check of the token of 500,000 to honor of the governor. Uh, Mr. Governor, you are a red gem with a big heart. Yeah. I appreciate you, sir. High point was the cutting of the birthday cake. Kingsley Uchebu, ITV News.